Good morning, Lindsay and Taylor. Diana Tamer is an oncology pharmacist and professor right here at UMKC. Now, her passion is teaching in her field because she believes that that is the way that she can positively impact the most amount of cancer patients. So take a look at your screen. You'll see this visit she was able to take, which was all part of the African Access Initiative. She went into practice sites to see where the gaps were present and then developed on-site training based on this. She found the largest gaps were in matching drugs to mutations, patient care, and cancer guidelines. Now, don't get me wrong, she might have been the teacher here, but she said that she was able to learn so much from this trip. They don't have a formal oncology training, but they have cancer patients like the rest of the world. You know, we have a ton of cancer patients, but very little people trained to uh, to treat these cancer patients. So this is the hardest part. It takes me about three years to teach someone here and we did that in four days. That was one of the most incredible things to hear, just how much she was able to pack in in such a short amount of time. Uh, by the trip's end, she found herself meeting with uh, government officials, representatives uh, in the Ivory Coast to uh, talk about ways uh, that they could implement her training full time and the resources that um, it would take for this to happen. I mean, at least just to hear that it, you could save lives, you know, just be a matter of training. At least yeah. what drew her to take part in this incredible experience? Yeah, so she, you know, has this passion for academia regardless, and she, again, feels like this is how she can connect and impact the most amount of people. But when she heard about the call for this specific training, uh, one of the requirements was that the training needed to be in French. And uh, she's from Lebanon, so French is her uh, native language, and she took all of this as a sign that this was just the right mission for her, and she hopes to continue contributing to it. Took it as a sign. How many times have you heard someone say, it just felt like what I was supposed to do? And that's what, yeah, what she's doing effect. there. Love that. Yeah.